Welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. I have my FabFitFun Winter 2020 box and add-ons here. I have had it for a while. I just haven't gotten around to filming this. So I'm going to get right into it because I was anxious to finally open it. They seem to have rethought their packaging instead of doing one big box and then having the actual seasonal box within that box. They're doing this and including everything inside so I think that's kind of awesome it seems like they're going to save on some paper products and this is also a much more recyclable material so add-ons first oh I got one of these daily concepts exfoliating gloves it was really inexpensive I've gotten one before I think this is five dollars and you use it in the shower I do really like it I honestly feel like this works better than any other kind of like exfoliating products that I've ever gotten. So I really, really did enjoy using these and I think I threw mine away. They got kind of old. So they're just like this. You put them on and you use them on your body when you shower. They really exfoliate. So you definitely want to use a moisturizer afterward. And it comes with this little rubber thing that you can mount uh, into your shower and then hang the gloves on. Next, I got the OPI Nail Envy Nail Strengthener. I just figured why not. I love nail products and I like OPI a lot. I actually kind of forgot that I had gotten a nail strengthener to be honest but I also got their rapid dry top coat. Okay and then I got and I know if you watch my channel a lot you know that I'm pretty strict cruelty free. So Living Proof is cruelty free but they're on by Unilever and Unilever is not cruelty free but I did kind of break the rule for myself I just haven't found anything that's worked in my hair as well as the Living Proof products. I love their products. They smell great. I Like I said, they were great in my hair. Just love them. And I really like the Restore line. The Restore hair mask is the best hair mask I've used ever in my hair. So I got this. This was in the Boost options for the actual box. And this is the shampoo and conditioner and the uh, leave-in conditioner. So I got that. I also got the Laura Geller Lash Boss Max Mascara. I got the regular Lash Boss Mascara in a previous sale and I really, really like it. I actually talked about it in a product review video. And the one thing I'm really excited about with this one is the spoolie. Look at that spoolie. So interesting. So I'm excited to use that kind of a spoolie. I wanted to try that for a while now. And then I got the Pure Heels Propolis 80 Sleeping Pack. This is a sleeping mask, I believe. At least that's what I read when it was available. Yeah, sleeping mask. I don't know why the front of this says sleeping pack, but there it is. And I have heard great things about the Pure Heels brand. They're K-Beauty. And I've heard that this is a great sleeping mask, so I'm excited to try that. I've mentioned in some of my review videos that I haven't seen one K-Beauty line of products that's been available in the Pocket Fun sales that has bad reviews. So excited to try some of the K-Beauty stuff. I haven't really tried much of it, but that's my first thing, I think. So I'll let you know what I think. If you're new to my channel, I do do a lot of actual product review videos because I searched far and wide for them um, when I first joined Bad Fit Fun and I couldn't find them. So I thought, well, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and make some myself. Okay, that was actually all of my add-ons. I didn't get too, too many. As usual, I, put, I will put in the description box down below what I got and what I paid for each item if you're curious to see. And then yes, everything comes in one box. So all of the add-ons were on top. This is the magazine we have Katie Couric featured on this magazine. So all of the information on the products that are in my box or that you could have gotten is in this magazine. So we're gonna go through what I got and we're gonna talk about what I could have gotten. So in case you're curious to see that and you're watching it for that. So if you don't know much about FabFitFun, you also get a whole bunch of like coupons and inserts. I feel like there are more here than there used to be. There's a HelloFresh one and et cetera. Oh, and a sticker. I got a sticker this time. I have no idea where I would put that. Okay, so the first thing I got in my box is this Unhide Blanket. It is a really well-loved blanket. I went ahead and picked it as my choice. It is worth $65. Uh, if you don't know, Unhide is actually a brand founded by Ellen DeGeneres, and it is uh, all about not using fur. That's what's called Unhide. So. 
Um, if I didn't choose that, I could have gotten this Vera Bradley pouch. That is a makeup bag and it retails for $50. I could have gotten the Bombshee Sloan Champagne flutes. It's there. And those retail for $51. Could have gotten this robe. And that retails for $70. That's a summer, summer and Rose Cozy Robe. And could have gotten the Lolly Beauty Tea Seed Elixir. That's this right here. It's like an oil. And that retails for $42. Or you could have gotten the Kate Spade New York Rise and Shine Stud Earrings. And these, those are they right here. And those retail for $68. Or you could have gotten, this one had so many choices, a Mobile White Advanced Teeth Whitening Kit, and that retails for $89.99, and that's just kind of a little picture there. It's one of those ones that you put in your mouth and it lights up. I think you plug it into your phone. I'll never wrap my hand head around those. But anyway, so that was choice one. I'm trying to speed through these because I'm actually on a break from work, so forgive me if, I feel, if you feel like I'm talking quickly. The next choice, what did I even get? So I got for the next choice, the Lucky Brand Solid Brushed Scarf. And this is $69.50. And really it's just a gray scarf. I mean, you can get the idea if I show you the picture. That's it right there. Let's see how the material actually feels though. It feels soft, it feels soft. I don't even know what the material is. It doesn't say what the material is anywhere, but it retails for $69.50. Or you could have gotten these Lily Pulitzer mugs, ceramic mugs, and they retail for $42, wow. Or you could have gotten the Caudalie Vino Source Moisturizing Sorbet, and it retails for $39. It's that one right there. You can look that one up on Sephora. Or you could have gotten the Murad Rapid Collagen Infusion. It retails for $78. It's right there. That one you can look up on Sephora and or Ulta. Or you could have gotten the Algenus Complete Iron Renewal Balm, that's right here, and that retails for $68, that one's on Sephora if you want to look it up. You could have also gotten the Impressions Vanity Company LED Vanity Mirror, and that is that right there, and that retails for $45. Now, for the next choice, I got the Ilia Limitless Lash Mascara. And darn, I already have mascara on, otherwise I would show you what it looks like. But again, I do review videos, so be on the lookout. If you haven't subscribed, consider subscribing if you uh, wanna see those kinds of videos. So this is it, this is the Ilia packaging. That's It's Clean Beauty, they're a very sustainable company available at Sephora. This mascara had decent reviews, you can look it up. Let's see what the spoolie looks like. The spoolie is kind of one of those plastic ones. Should be able to make that out with fairly sparse bristles. So anyway, it had pretty decent reviews. I love mascaras. So as you can see, I got two in this box. I was just actually thinking, huh, I have a lot of mascaras right now. I had that thought this morning. So I do not need any more mascaras in my life at this point. Uh, okay, so that's what I got and that retails for $28 and then if you didn't get that you could have gotten the Laura Geller cinnamon and spice eyeshadow palette, which is right there Or you could have gotten a dr. Brandt skincare pores no more pure purifying cleanser and it retails for $36. It's right there or you could have gotten the dr. Brandt skincare pore dermabrasion and that retails for $58 right there or you could have gotten the Lily Sadugi Maroon Velvet Headband that retails for $49, right there. That one looks really cute. Would have been really cute for the holidays. So for the next choice, I got the, and for the next choice, I got the Vore Hair Care Rhythm of the Rain Hair Mask and Scalp Detox, and that retails for $28. It's right here. It has good reviews on Ulta. I will tell you, I did try their shampoo and conditioner and I wasn't terribly impressed at first. I really didn't like it. And then it was fine. I wouldn't recommend it buying it, but this has better reviews than their shampoo and conditioner. So I'm looking forward to trying it. We'll see, we'll see. Or you could have gotten the Kate Spade New York workout socks. They retail for $24 and they're right there. Or you could have gotten the Tula Skincare Rose Glow and get it cooling and brightening eye balm. And that is right here. Then it retails for $30. Or you could have gotten the Muck Lux Cabin Socks. They retail for $25 and they're right there. 
or you could have gotten the Flight Mode Skincare High Altitude Hydration Mask, and it's right there. I did a review video on all of the spoilers for the box, so I will link that down below if you want to know what my thoughts are on all of the products that were available. I share those in that video. So for the next choice, I got the Butanique Beauty Guardian Angel Revitalizing Eye Gels, and they retail for $25. And they're just under eye gel mask patch things. Or you could have gotten the Apare cutting board set of four and they retail for $19.95 and they're right there. Or you could have gotten the DP Hue Apple Cider Vinegar Dry Shampoo Powder and that retails for $25, $24 and that is right here. So for the next choice, this was one that FabFitFun was going to pick for you. And I got the Vanilla Bean Lip Scrub from Wish. And I'm very, very happy with that. Actually, of that choice, this is what I was hoping for. So this one retails for 20 bucks. I actually have one of their lip scrubs that comes in like a tub. And I really, really love it. I've had it for a long time and it's still going strong and I use it regularly. But now I have this one from them. Actually, this could end up being a gift because I don't know why. I'll ever end up finishing the one I have from them. I don't think I've even gotten halfway through, but I really like it, so I bet I would like this too. So you could have gotten the Wish Lip Scrub, or you could have gotten the Paradox Lucky Stars Blemish Patches, and that's right here, and they're in the shape of stars. So it's kind of cute, and they retail for $18. Or you could have gotten the Below the Belt Croc card case, and it retails for $35. It's fake leather. And that's right there where my middle finger is. And then for the next choice, you could have either gotten the Daily Concepts Daily Facial Dry Brush, and it retails for $20. It's right here. Or you could have gotten, which I got, and actually this is what I wanted from this choice too, so I am really getting pretty lucky with this. These are the Nora Jewelry Ombre Leopard Scrunchies, and they retail for $25. Wow. And there are three of them. I don't love leopard for myself, but I do appreciate it, so this is nice. I don't really have any scrunchies. I haven't really jumped on board with this trend. I mean, I did when I was 12, but now that it's back, I haven't jumped on board since. So scrunchies, cool. Of those choices, like I said, that's what I wanted. And then the next FabFitFun choice, you could have gotten, what did I get? Let's see. I got the Phase Zero Blush. I don't think I had a preference for what I would have gotten for this choice, really. It looks like this, and it retails for $27.50. And this is what it looks like. I'm not gonna open it, it might go in a giveaway, but that's what it looks like. Or you could have gotten the London Town Get Well Nail Recovery, and that retails for $20. It's right there, it's just a clear nail polish thing. Or you could have gotten the Aesthetica Liquid Eyeliner, and that retails for $21, and that's right there. And then I also got, and I will probably eat it now, I got a sample that I didn't know I was gonna get. This is the Kind Thins. I love Kind Bars. So this is thinner, so it's kind of like a mini version, I guess. And it's in dark chocolate that's in sea salt and it's 90 calories. I'm gonna eat it probably now. I'm breastfeeding, I'm hungry a lot. And then that is it for everything you could have gotten in the box. Again, I'm sorry if it felt like I went really quickly. I am trying to just squeeze filming this into my break, but if you haven't subscribed, consider subscribing. I hope you're doing well and staying safe and sane during this time. It seems endless, doesn't it? <sighs> anyway, despite it all, I hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you in my next video. Bye.